Uh, you can still see him with the thermal visor, but it, once you have to go back to combat visor, it's really annoying and you, it's very hard to see him. So I'm actually going to save the super missile for that time instead of the other way around. And I talked right through the segment, right? Uh, I'm just going to be kind of hitting it when I can. Ah, keep getting frozen. Oh, by the way, just keep tapping B if you get frozen like that. Okay, thermal visor overloaded. Alright, I'm gonna hit this thing as fast as I can to get rid of the blizzard. Okay, I did it. Sweet. And we got the huge one now. This is actually the easiest one to hit because it's the biggest target. See, I hit it right there without even, like, aiming at him or doing anything to prepare. Did I hit him again? I can't tell. Well, Thardis is a pretty easy boss. Uh, a lot of nostalgia for me for this game because this is the fifth GameCube game I got, I think. Uh... And this is... Ah, God. Don't worry, the snowstorm actually goes away after a while. Oh my God, I hit him when he was in rock formation. I didn't think you could do that with that one. And th there's another easy target. You, you just keep on doing that. I seem to be doing a really good job of dodging you when you do that for some reason. And, um... I should probably upload all parts today, but eh, I don't feel like it. I have driver's training all these days, you gotta realize, too, so I have to study and record and upload, and I just have appointments that most kids don't have, and I'm missing horribly with the charge man, so I think I'll just pepper it with fire, or pepper it with fire from the power beam, whatever. Hooray! He's a bowling ball. That didn't make any sense. I don't know what I was trying to say there. I'm very, like, hyper for some reason. I got up like an hour ago. I record early in the morning, so I'll have, I'll have more time to upload later today. Come on, go out already, jeez. It's been a while. God. You have to just keep jumping to get out of that stuff. Stop turning into a rock. This is where the boss gets kind of annoying, because it's kind of hard to hit him from long range. I, I should start using missiles, honestly. I think I'm going to use missiles. Watch me use one missile and then blow up. Or, like, not even hit it. Come on. Thank you. Okay, this is the... Again, this is where the hard part kind of comes in. Yay, I missed. It's a lot easier to tell if you're hitting him or not in combat visor, because the phase on rock kind of goes red. I have no idea where he is. Well, actually, this might help. <laughs> this is the horrible, like, color, I guess. Thank you! Apparently, uh, the thermal visor does not react well to phase on, and the storm kind of stops here. What is he planning? I forgot this attack. Oh, it's just more lightning. You can't hurt him here, so just stay away. So yeah, the storm kind of stops, which is a good thing. Now it's his chest. I forgot how many rocks. This is either the sixth or seventh. This is a kind of a long boss battle, or long-winded, as Big Tip on a bus. Oh my gosh, said like three times in one segment of Pikmin. It was great. Did I hit him there? I think I did. It usually goes down with a super missile. Uh, let's go. It, this is a pretty easy target too, because it's right in the middle of him. A lot easier. This, again, this boss battle is an example of something that's easier in the original Metroid Prime because, in, you know, lock on without having to aim. But I like, again, it just gives, I think, more of a challenge in uh, Trilogy, obviously. And Thardis is almost dead, and he's dead. Nope, he's not dead yet. One more shot. He's dead. That was a really loud noise. I'm wondering if my microphone is louder today than it usually is because something screwed up with my microphone. Sometimes it's really quiet, sometimes it's horribly loud. I haven't been able to get it to a medium. Most of the time it's been really quiet. I know that my videos are quieter than most things on YouTube. Hooray! Samus gets hit in the back of the head with a rock. Uh, easy but long boss battle. Over? Oh yeah, you can't... For some reason you can't draw in pickups after a boss fight, but, you know, let's get the spider ball. Oh, the memories here. 
I played this kid game so much when I was a kid and couldn't figure it out. So I got a strategy guide. This is one of the first games I got a strategy guide for. So now that we have the spider ball, we can go up spider ball tracks. Kind of obvious. Since this is the first one I saw, I guess I'll just go up this one. Actually, first I need to go down up this one. I think there's a missile expansion I can get here. Ah, come on. Wait. Did I forget something? Oh, wait, we can't- I don't think I can get across that wave beam door until I have- Shit, what am I doing? I- I think I'm doing it wrong. I- I don't know. <laughs> uh, well, wrong. Wrong spider ball track to be going up. And let's spend about a month going this way. Um... Yeah, so Thardis is kind of dead and whatnot. Um, what's next? I think you have to get, like, the... There's a bunch of missile expansions and stuff we can get now, so that's gonna be segments nine, uh, 17 and 18, but... There's a bunch of stuff we can do now, like I just kind of said. I think I'm gonna go down this tunnel. I don't remember where all the pathogens leave. Um, I think the ice beam is the next power-up you have to get, though. Is this something to chose our ruins? Oh, Magmore Caverns. First, I'm gonna see what's up with Spider Ball Track. Is this an ice beam door? Yep, it's an ice beam door, so. I'll just assume I have to go back to Magmore Caverns. Hopefully, I can make it to a save station before the 22 minute mark because. Yeah, that would kinda suck if I couldn't. Because that's what I had to do for the last one, although the save station was just like two rooms away. Anyway, back to Magmore Caverns. Don't try using the thermal visor here, like, at any point, because look what happens. Well, not here. This isn't the best place to use it. But, yeah, it kind of gets really hard to see. So let's try it for a little while and get a horrible thumbnail. Okay, this is, here it isn't so bad. This is Magmore Workstation. I think there's stuff to get here, but I'll check that after I'm done killing parrot space or flying space pirates. It took me forever to say that, as usual. Missiles aren't that hard to dodge if you space jump over them, and there's another one, isn't there? Yep. Again, I can't hear game audio, so... Yeah. Why did I just stand still for that? Uh, I seem to remember there being an energy tank you can get here, so let me just do that puzzle. If, if, if I even can. I don't know if I can or not. So, if you scan this thing... Oh wait, this is where you have to do the conduit thing. That's why this room is a little bit darker, so you can kind of see what you're doing. <coughs> I assume I'm just going to do this puzzle and then make my way to a save station in three minutes. Uh, the other one's over there. So yeah, now this thing kind of starts working. Because it's energized with one shot of the wave beam. Wouldn't it need constant energy? I believe this entire puzzle is timed. Uh, I don't know. I could be wrong. I could be wrong a lot about a lot of things. Like, is this even worthwhile? I, I don't know. So, quickly get in here. Scan up this area. And then it lead, then that opens up another door and drives another path for you to go on. And then do the same thing again and it opens up another path and drives it on and then I think you get a, like a missile expansion or something. It might be an energy tank, I, c I don't know. Wait, what color was it? I guess it was over here. Since this path seems to be awfully dry. So yeah, just keep on doing this. I hope I can make it to a save station soon. Um... Oh, come on. Let's go. No. No. No time for... Oh, come on! That was dick. No! Come on! Let me go! You pricks! They're just, like, working together! And they don't die! Oh, come on! Well, it's too late now, and I think I'm going through the wrong door anyway. Nope. Energy tank acquired. That sucked. What the... Oh god, oh god, oh god. I didn't realize it went back. Jeez. 
and somehow they both just died. What the hell? Alright, well that was kind of a, an ordeal. Um, where's the next, I, I hope there's a save station in here, because then I'd like to end the segment a little bit early. Or at all, I guess. Okay, I can't get through a workstation tunnel, I don't have the ice beam. Wait, can I get through here? I don't know. I don't know anything anymore. Alright, how do I get through this area now? Okay, I guess you just jump up there. I hope there's a save station somewhere, because I'm dangerously low on time. Eh, uh, get to a save station. Please be a save station in the next room. Oh, but I should scan that thing, but not now. I don't have time. Oh, okay, I, I'm out of time. Assume I get to a save station safely. Bye.